what is MLflow? It is actually the most successful ML ops project today. It has 11 million downloads from May 2022. So MLflow is actually an open source platform for the machine learning lifecycle. And what does MLflow do? It has those four major components. It can help you tra do tracking. So track your code, track your data, configuration results, and some model related information as well. And ML uh, project can help you packaging to different format to like help with the reproducibility of the runs on any platform. For MLflow models, a general, it has a general format that standardized deployment path. And my MLflow model registry is a centralized and co collaborative uh, model lifecycle management. By now you might still be confused by uh, why do I even need MLflow? What does it actually do? So you no longer need to manually write down a lot of information during your model development phase. You no longer need to like have a thousand Excel file open and just log all the detailed information. With this one line of code here, mlflow.tensorflow.autolog, you can see that I actually store those information automatically. So this is our MLflow UI. So you can see, oh, here is the di different beta values being logged. And this is our like learning rate and number of epochs and validation set accuracy, the 92% we saw previously. So in the background, MLflow already helps you autolog this information. If you rerun your notebook many times with different parameters, you will just see more and more rows coming in here. And you can analyze those results very easily by clicking compare or download into CSV file and programmatically even access it. The model information is also automatically being logged. Those are under the artifact tab. So you can see related to the requirement, con the YAML file, and even a model summary over here. It's very, very convenient.